Now I'm just going to give a quick reminder here that I'm going to put some timestamps in the video. So if you want to make it quicker, please do it as you wish. Uh, you don't really have to watch the entire video. It's kind of me ranting. So yeah. So the video is going to start short after the intro. Hey guys. I did Gaming Horizon back at it again with another video and today we're gonna update this tutorial about uh, the IPEGA controller situation well there is a lot of people actually that complained that it doesn't work but when they complained they gave me a different like uh, controller model it's not the 9068 now I apologize that I didn't put the controller model on the title so it's kind of misleading it's just un, it's a I, an IPEGA controller so every controller must work right so I apologize for the misleading title this time it's going to be working okay now I'm just gonna clear up a few things number one um, the connection method method is not same for every controller it doesn't so number two not all of these controllers support PC wired connection so as far as I know the 9068 is the only controller that works with wired connections other uses like 2.4 2.4 G uh, receiver and some stuff so I'm gonna be showing it to you actually right now. Now there, I uh, I screenshot some of the five comments that it's in the video. So here is the comment number one. Okay, mine is a 9090 IPEGA, and I tried to follow along, but it didn't work every time I tried. Now, it's not actually wired connection. Now, as I said, is a 2.4 gigahertz of receiver wireless USB receiver now I'm gonna try to find the uh, manual by the way uh, if you can't find the connection method in your manual maybe it's actually online maybe it's not updated you know maybe some of the manuals are just in Chinese which 9090 is just Chinese so it doesn't really take a lot of time to translate it just use Google Translate that's what actually I did to find some information that I needed so this is the IPEGA 9090 and I took a little time but it's just like 10 minutes and this is this this is the instruction that was given to connect with PC and I use Google Translate so it says 2.4 G model so when you search I peg a uh, 9090 and look at um, just like search up the I peg a model and then look at the official website which is m.ipega.hk and then when you click it just scroll down a little bit and sometimes you have to look to the product to understand now you see this this USB thingy is a 2.4 gigahertz receiver it's kind of USB but it's wireless so it's like a wireless mouse but it's a controller so you know kind of a little bit of a difference there and also you should look at the product details that it supports Windows 10 now I've seen one uh, controller that doesn't support Windows uh, I'm gonna get to that later but it supports Windows 10 and then look at the instructions there is a user manual and if the controller doesn't have a user manual you'll see a direct play mode user manual now this manual is not for PC it's just for 
basically PUBG, Arena of Valor, some shooting games and MOBA games. It doesn't work on Windows. So don't get your hopes up. So if if this is the only user manual available on controller, it means you're out. It doesn't work on PC. So you should just look it up. I don't I'm not supposed to explain this all to you. It's because you should look it up. Just type IPEGA9090, get the use download the user manual that PDF, translate this thing and you're good. And we're gonna go move over to the next one. It's weird that IPEGA didn't document these features and setting in the user manual. Or did they? They actually did. And you guys are not searching it up. Okay, next comment. Hi, I hope that I can get a reply. Do this method work on 9090? Search it up, for the love of God. Hi sir, does this process applies for IPEGA 9083S? 9083S looks like this. 9083S. Now when you look it up, eh, we're getting a slow connection right now. Okay, so I'm just going to look at the PDF. We're not going to waste time here. Uh, let me try to uh, search it up for a little bit. Hold on. Okay. Oh, wait. No, it's a direct play mode thingy. It's a 9083S. Ah, here it is. So it's a 9083S, right? So I'm gonna just look for the English one. There's a English version right here. And there is a mode available available for PC, I think. Uh, let me just uh, look, look around for a little bit. Oh wait, this is the controller that doesn't support Windows. Now when I looked it up, it actually does not support Windows. As you could see here, support playing games, Bluetooth enabled, Android, iOS smartphones, tablets, smart TV, direct play mode, um, Android 6, iOS 11, nothing. It's not available. Uh, 9083S is the controller that doesn't support Windows so uh, the answer to this question is you can't play on Windows here you just can't please help me my IPEGA I can't connect my IPEGA 9118 9118 now it's a golden warrior Bluetooth thing now let me just, uh, I actually down also downloaded the PDF file, so let's just search it up. 9118. So we're going to look for an uh, English one here. Oh no, it's not here. So it has a PC mode, here we go. So it needs... <laughs> A Bluetooth receiver so it's also not a wired connection so you need a Bluetooth receiver now do we have a next one or this is the final yet yeah, this is the final one and the final PDF is for the 9023 which is let me just check it uh, Okay, so it supports Windows 10. Oh, here we go. So 9023, there is a strict rule here, which you need the provided one, like the provided cable, to actually use the controller. So this is another wired connection for IPEGA controller. It's 9023. So uh, USB data cable. Oh, it's provided, so you can use any. And you don't need to press anything. So, did they mention 9023 here? Nope. I, 
there's none in my comment section. I don't know why I searched it up. Is Hello? Oh, here we go. So it says, does it work for 9023? It works with cable. You just, you're not supposed to press anything in there. So yeah, just a little bit of a clearance there just to clear something up. So yeah, basically what you need to do is search up the modal and then look at the website, search for the manual PDF and you, sh you should check if it supports Windows 10 and then proceed to look for a procedure to connect it either wireless or wired so yeah that's it for for today if you're having problems again please tell it in the comment section below and like or dislike i don't give a i don't give a crap so yeah subscribe if you like some educational stuff also if you want me to cover up some i don't know technical problems please tell it in the comments down below and this is me at A Gaming Horizon. I am out. Bye.